What's up everyone, uh, it's gonna be a quick down and dirty update video. I know I haven't posted anything for a uh, while since we chopped up the frame. Uh, the biggest issue I thought I was going to be facing was waiting for parts to come in. But it turns out uh, the reason why we haven't had any new videos was because my uh, brother got himself sick, unfortunately. Got the, uh, the old 19 and he's in the middle of a move, so Unfortunately, my editor is going to be down for the count for a little while, so this is this video has completely raw, no editing involved, so I'm not going to have an outro or intro or anything like that. So, write in the comments, wish him well, wish him a quick recovery, and I'll be helping him with the move, so hopefully we can get his uh, system back up and running down the road, because he's doing a hell of a job with the videos. Uh, but that being said, I'm going to show you what I've done to the chopper so far, letting you know that there is work being done to it. When you last saw us, uh, we had the yeah, we had the frame chopped off, and we were just mocking up that uh, 103 engine. Tomorrow, I'm going to start recording. Uh, Raven, right I'm going to start take, taking the transmission back off. Primary is already off. And I'm going to set it into the uh, frame what I have now. And I'm going to start, pack, start figuring out how I'm going to mount this properly. Uh, I'm, I'm hoping I can get away with using the uh, original rubber mounts. Fabricate something up with that. But as I'm looking at it, I'm probably going to have to make this uh, rigid mounted. Like my uh, 88 was. But, and like I said, to show you guys what I've done to the chopper so far. I already mocked up the hardtail. This is the 1975 shovel head uh, welding kit. Oh, hush. Oh. Everyone's a critic. <laughs> anyway, so I got this in. I also, where did I put it? That ain't it. Okay, I don't remember where I put it, but. <laughs> I got myself that uh, neck, I, the custom neck I had uh, ordering from Vulcan Engineering. So that that's in, I just gotta find it. But, and, oh yeah, before I forget, I got the metal for my down tubes. So I just gotta work on how to, oh wait, here it is. Yeah, let's show you this quickly. Ugh. Really hoping this all comes out in one video because GoPros don't like yeah, oh, of course I gotta fucking do that. Take out the knife. There we go. There we go. Show you this neck I have. Really bloody cool. Oh yeah. So here's my neck. Has a stopper. All made out of what was it? 1018 steel. Yeah, that's my old pulley. I'm not gonna need that anymore. So I got the steel for the down tubes. Uh, my DOM tubing for my uh, backbone is coming from uh, Vancouver. My mom's coming on and over, and she's gonna bring some of that with her. So I got the neck. I got the materials for the down for my down tube. I'm waiting for my back tube. So the frame is coming along. It's just one step at a time. So the hardest part we're going to be facing right now is the engine mounting. So stay tuned for that. I already have some video made, but like I said, I just got all I really can do at the moment is just make some small updates like this as we go along before we can actually make a solid proper 20, 25 minute video I used to post. I also want to say thank you for everyone who subscribed so far, even though it's been a while since I last uploaded. Thank you guys for all that and also for all the comments. Keep on posting in the comments and who knows, if I need to make some content, I'll actually make a video like this. So if you have a question, I'll probably make a video response for y'all. If you like that, drop a comment. If you want to see the uh, progress on the chopper build on 2003, mm, boy, outside. <laughs> if you want to get, you want to stay up to date on the chopper build from my 2003 soft tail to a chopper, Hit that bell icon. That's going to be your uh, best friend. And when I'm coming up to the end, I'll see y'all in the next video.